careful way I wanted to go down. Why is it? This character, I swear. The character is clumsy. Not me. Dang it. Welcome everyone, and thank you for joining me in Enshrouded, where last time we uh, did a shroud route and the story of Rot, I think. I don't even remember what the story was about. <laughs> I don't pay attention to that story stuff very much. It doesn't really click for me. I mean, the world is immersive enough for me. Like, the story is just kind of background to me, which is kind of, I don't know, seems how it was intended. But maybe it's just how it was intended for me. And everybody is different. So today, we do have obelisk research, which is over here. Somewhere we could definitely get to. So yeah, I think that was the main problem, is that in my original playthrough, I was following the Flameborn quests a lot more. Probably because, you know, you kind of have to, to get the levels you need as a single player. To get to the places you need to get to. So, oh, we've got this. So yeah, there's a shroud. Is that a shroud? That's got to be a shroud route right there. Yeah, I think it is. It's under this little thing here. So let's let's hit that up real quick. I don't know where that popped up from, but we'll get that. And then we will head to um, what obelisk research. Yeah, because we're still not quite ready. Set that active. We'll go to the waypoint first. And do I have all the stuff I need? That's the question. Shroud potions. I swapped this out for... Yeah, so I kept the knives, but yeah, I wanted to try this. See if it's any good, because it is um, all the way up, I'm pretty sure. Let's just double check that real quick. Yeah, you... Oh, um, oh uh, okay. <laughs> I don't know how we hit the bench instead of him. But yeah, we got 20 of those. We got... Oh. Oh. Missing mushrooms. Um, we should be on to the next one. We've got 27 right now, so we're good. And Fireball 2. That's right, I have not made... Mm, yeah, and you have to scroll down. Let's go ahead and... What, how many can we make? Quite a few. Let's make... Oh, it makes 100? I don't know. But, made a lot. So that, that should be good. And then some Fireball 1s. Sure. That'll be good. Alright, yes. I think we're all set. Yeah, I got some more of those That's as well. Because, yeah, we... I, I don't like carrying a torch if I don't have to. The only problem is the bees. But if you're a wand user, it's not too much of a big deal. And I got puppies to let in. So give me one second, we'll head out. Alright, we're back. So, we are heading... Oh, we don't really... Uh, we may as well, actually. It'll be faster to go from the spire. But... I hope the audio didn't change too much. I had to switch my chair position because Daisy, the dog, has decided to lay down right where I put my chair. Um, you know, as animals are wont to do. And so I have to have my chair scooted back because she doesn't want to move. <laughs> She's not even a year old yet. Freaking women rule my life. Oh, I should have uh, downed some water and some food before heading out. Mostly water for the stamina, but we should make it. Oh, it's, yeah, it's like down in there, isn't it? So I think I want to hit this hill. Yeah, right under there. So I think, yeah, right up here is going to be the best entrance location. Yeah. Bam. Yeah, that's perfect. Oh, actually, from, well, from here is easier to glide, I think. Yeah, because that's level with it, pretty much. So, before, yeah, we'll hit that. That. And, yeah, shroud guys are weak to fire. Can we make it? Yes, nice. Okay, I thought so. There are dudes. Oh, uh, now. Probably should have shot some of them from long range. Might have been a good plan. Oh no. And hit that. Oh, probably didn't need a fireball too. Um, are you critters? They are critters. And down she goes. Nice and easy. The problem is I don't think there's a good way out of this place. Um Whoa. Hello. 
lots of critters. I don't mind the ones that spawn out of the ground so much though, because at least they only spawn the one time. Is there a spawner around? Oh, that is a spawner, isn't it? It sure is. Hit it. Oh, hit it again, I guess. Man, Fireball 2 isn't even good enough? Sheesh. Is it dead? Oh, it's doing the same thing? Well, now it's definitely dead. Sorry, I had puppies whining at me there for a second. Like, what, what do you guys need? Not really sure. Usually they whine because, it's, you know, they're tired. But when I start talking for the video, I think it wakes them up. And that's the only thing that makes any sense to me. Why they're always awake. Oh, I've never gone... Cause, yeah, we came from that way. What is this way? Um, can we just fry you a little bit? Yeah, they don't take much to get those out of your way. Oh, I see. This is the proper way to get there. I think I came this way in my other playthrough, actually. Yeah, as I recall, I certainly did. Okay. So should we even bother heading back? I think we're good to go still. That's not as close as it looks. But let's try it. We can at least, you know, ascertain. Did you get um, well, the textures are not good, so there's that. They said they fixed it. I think they made it worse. I don't know, at least in mine. I mean, I'm running on PC, and I mentioned, you know, my, my PC is not, no slouch. Like, it's not the, the absolute best, but it's certainly up there. So, yeah, to get over there, could we glide it? Make it very high. I think we could try it. Um, maybe put some shroud potion on. I do like that they changed how the climbing works. The climbing does seem to work better. So yeah, just in case, let's throw us on a shroud potion. And we shall head. Yeah, like what did we even pick up? Not even that much. Um, yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> I didn't really realize how full this had got. Oh, is that... Oh, Fireball 1, Fireball 2. I see. So, are you Fireball? You're Fireball 2. You're Fireball 2. That doesn't help at all. I, yeah, should have thought about that. I need a bigger backpack. <laughs> Alright. Uh, Geronimo. That's the one. Thinking of what you say when you jump off of things. Geronimo. Of course. Um, there's nowhere good to land. Well, I guess that's not terrible. Yeah, it could be worse. Oh, there's my body, too. What was that body from? That was the... Um, oh, dang it. What you call it? There's got to be a spot, right? Oh, man. No, don't fall lower. The uh, elixir well with the thunder brutes. Yeah. All right. We'll build a freaking shelf. That, that ought to do it. There. I know. I just didn't want to bother with it. And it took less time to do it than it would have taken to just... Or, yeah, than I took griping about it. How do we get up there? It looked like there's a trail that way, but is there a faster way? There's a little cave here. See, they need more little secrets like that. Like little caves like this that lead to cool places. But they just don't... I don't know. Sometimes they do. But... Not as much as they should. Oh, crap. <laughs> Ran out of stamina at the war's time. There we go. That'll kick it into high gear. I always have to go the hard way, too. Because you can probably just run around over there. I don't know. I like to test boundaries sometimes with, with simple things. Not like trying to beat bosses. Yeah, there's no good way. We'll just have to go around this way. They just kind of trick you. They're like, we'll put some shelves here and let you think that possibly... Yeah, see, even this looks like... Oh, is that the same spot? That's probably the same spot. I was saying it would be the perfect spot for a little secret cave entrance up to that location. Man, I'm so used to my other character who can just run for such a longer amount of time than this girl. What is this? Oh, that is chamomile. We do need that for a current health potion, I believe. That's like the first 
like upgraded health potion or is it just the first health potion takes chamomile i don't remember ah the mushroom boys we don't need to fight the mushroom but what that that mushroom boy is, is having some trouble he's been wedged into the dirt oh so we are going this way we're going past the mushroom boys we don't need to interact with them they're over there we need to go over here to the tents i do believe don't we uh, there's nobody here always a good sign right and yeah, stone is not that big a deal I'll take it. We do need to knock down one of our altars. Keep forgetting about that. And the boars. Are they weak to fire? I think they are. Animals are all weak to fire. I do believe. He's just gonna... And he's got a friend over there. So yeah, he's just gonna run up on us in a second anyway. So we'll go ahead and preempt him. Oh, he didn't like that much. Oh, that totally missed because he got... <laughs> I was trying to lead him. And he got glitched into the ground. So yeah, there's definitely more glitching into the ground issues happening that I've been noticing. I mean, it's always been happening, but I think it's happening more. Because I think at least almost one enemy a play session gets totally glitched into the ground. Ooh. I just, I, glad I managed to dodge that because I totally did not get the shield up in time. They do have the good meat and skins that I can use, which is useful. Um, yeah, there. Just fill. Oh, because yeah, I thought I sensed another little piggy. It's usually three little piggies. That's how the story goes. But you guys, they built their house of twigs. See? Oh yeah, see, they built it out of twigs. So that's what happens. You need to build it out of bricks, you fools. <laughs> Sorry, my daughter's seven, and yeah, she's past that age, but it wasn't that long ago. What are you guys doing out here? Oh, uh, you must have chased that thing all the way from way the crap in the shroud. So, I guess these guys are more interactive now? Or just sometimes... Oh, what's this? Just a little glow stuff area to mine things. No, there's something that happens here at some time. There. Don't remember. It's very intense music for the bats. Um, I'm gonna grab some of this stuff because I don't think I have yet. Or have I? Maybe I have. I'm gonna scroll. Yeah, I guess I have gotten it before, but it's not saying anything new for us unless you don't get anything new for this. seem that way. Oh, and then these. These ones are the ones I need. I need to start growing those. Sure. Yeah. Alright. I think that's good for... Yeah, let's grab this one too. Keep growing these for ourselves. Because that's the way to do things. Don't depend on farming it in the wild. I mean, you can if you want to play that way, I suppose. Okay, where are we going? We're going up here probably, right? Oh, and now my dogs... Whoa! Dogs want to go out, but let's go up here so the wolf doesn't kill me. Or is the wolf up here? Wolf could be up here, I suppose. Oh, he is up here. Ow. Yeah, and you gotta be careful. Oh, come on, blow it up now. Oh, I should have done long range. Oh, well. Yeah, and then if I don't blow it up, there is the added bonus that I can actually walk on this stuff because it still exists. Um, if you blow the things up, then things tend to not exist anymore. Alright, this is the perfect spot. Give me one second. Never mind. They just wanted my attention. They have learned, as most smart puppies do, that um, clawing at the door gets me to pay attention to them when I would uh, otherwise not, because, you know, they need to go outside use the restroom. And that's what you do with puppies. But yeah, so progress. Also, headaches. After weeks of in-depth study, I've found parallels between the simplified ancient phonic characters to the historic origins of uh, phonemic, or phonetic, yeah, characters to the origins of uh, phenomic, human writing. Yeah, phonetic and phenomic. I used to know the difference between those two things. <laughs> uh, I theorize that the modern alphabetical system may have deviated, uh, may, der may be derivative of the ancient syllabary. 
Sadly, the investigation could not continue due to a deathly and strange odor emitted from a nearby opening. It has clouded the minds of my researchers and caused everyone headaches, just like the ancient writing, but worse. Why did the ancients not simply create a traditional alphabet instead of relying on multiple unique overly complex symbols for every single syllable? Pictograms would have done the job too. Yeah, Lorraine Grim. Grim? Who is it? Read that again. I just want to... Hey. Oh, I was hitting R. R doesn't work. Yeah, Lorraine Krim. Uh, she has more story in Pike, I believe. I already have one, so that's why I grabbed that. We'll just stack on the one I've already got. This is what we're looking for, though. Yeah, these are hard to capture. <laughs> I had to fake it for the uh, thumbnail in the last ep uh, episode. Uh, nestled within the Starfall Kingdom, a uh, chasm so deep, its contents have eluded us for millennia. No secret can resist illumination by light of the eternal flame. An ar archaic evil brewing, growing. Uh, it must be buried, flooded, and sealed. Uh, humanity should never brush against the these tendrils of pandemonium. That was kind of fitting that it became nighttime right as we were reading that. Um, so that is over here, all done. I suppose we can head on home, because I'm not going to explore at night right now. I'll see you guys in the morning. Alright, I've got the situation figured out. I don't know how much daylight I've burned. Hopefully not too much is that. That is... Uh, which way is that? That should be... Oh, that's west. Oh, so the sun is already setting. <laughs> I might just go ahead and burn through till the next day. Yeah, uh, let me just do a little bit around here. All right, it is morning, but I actually went through two days because I uh, forgot that. Yeah, so it is definitely morning. I just slept through the night, so we're facing north. But if we turn left, which would be west, that's going to be where the sun comes up. Because I don't know if they did that on purpose, but yeah, the sun rises in the west, sets in the east. At least, unless the map's upside down. Because, yeah, the sun rises on this side, which is west. And it sets on this side, which is the east. I um, mean, um, maybe it's... Is it Australia? No. This isn't Australian developers. Because sometimes, I mean, in ancient times, Australians used to flip the map upside down. But yeah, so <laughs> I uh, started building because I was like, I need to kill some time. So I just started building and I extended the flame so that we can build over here now. Um, Yeah, so... I walled this building in, put doors in, and I don't know what to do with it. Yeah, I haven't got it over here. It's, uh, the line is pretty much right here now, I think. I should have kept the hammer on so you guys could see it, but it's, yeah, we got that building now. I put a little bridge <laughs> because, I yeah, there's no way currently to get upstairs except by going, it's like a, a secret upstairs. You have to go to the other building <laughs> and then, whoops, yeah, go upstairs here. Whoa. And, yeah, I'm getting stuck on everything. And head out here through the window, of course. And then there's upstairs. I don't know if I'm going to put stairs in here or put a ladder in or something. I don't know. Figure something out. What is with the... Oh, I can dismantle that now? Oh, these you can. The floor in here you couldn't. Like this wooden floor and this bit of stone. I couldn't do anything with that. But yeah, apparently you can dismantle these. So that's cool. That'd be our, our uh, pet rat. Where's he at? Uh, he doesn't spawn in our house, does he? Well, I guess I wouldn't be able to know because I opened all the doors. Whoa! There they are. Freaking A. <laughs> Crap. Yeah, pull a weapon out. Weapons help. Why are there rats in my base? Because <laughs> I've made the dumb choice to choose this area. Uh, I don't know. It makes it more fun, kind of. I don't think I want anything from rats. But, yeah, on that note, we should probably um, get up some berries. Sure. And also hit up some water. Good water. And that one. And that'll be better. Yeah. But, so we have a new house. We just have to... I don't know if torches help. Kind of like Minecraft. The mobs don't spawn if there's torches around, but maybe. And I got puppies I need to let in. Then we'll head right out. Alright, I think they're settled down. Or at least settling down. Um, are we all set on stuff? Yeah, I sorted out the magic, I think. Fireball 1, we got 200, 202s, some lightning just in case. Yeah, a fair number of explosive arrows. Everything's, yeah, healed up. Yeah, good to go. It's pretty much morning, so what are we heading off to do? I think we're heading off to do an elixir well. Because our next west 
obelisk. Where are you at? Yeah, show you. Yeah, it's way over there. We are not doing that anytime soon. We need to do that before anything. So that's the next thing, I believe, in the masonry tools. Yeah, so we'll go over here. Because this is the one where we died. Is our... I think my body is gone now. Yes, it appears my body... Maybe it's if you sleep through the night, your body goes away? I don't know. I'm gonna have to do more tests on that to be certain. Oh, what best way? I guess from here is the best way to get there, huh? Unfortunately, the spires are usually the best way. Especially once you get the upgraded glider, like the full upgraded one. Um, yeah, we're not- we're just heading to the waypoint. Feels this way. Yeah. I just healed up, so no, it's more that way, isn't it? Yeah, about this way, I think. Hopefully, yeah, we should be able to make it over the shroud. I mean, not that it's a big deal, it's just kind of hard to get out of sometimes. Oh, there's a bridge there over the shroud. What bridge is that for? Um, yeah, usually the bridges, or is that, um, yeah, that's a bridge. I'm gonna say, or is that the, another uh, elixir well? And there's some sort of tower over this way. Let's see if we can see what's at this tower. Just fly on through the trees. I don't think the branches actually exist. Oh, yeah, I can't see anything. Whoa, hello, hello. <laughs> that was a little closer than I think I should have landed. Here, footsteps. What are the footsteps? I can't stand that. Oh, is it traps? It sounds like traps. Yeah, okay. Traps are not such a big deal. I don't remember this at all. No. I don't remember. Uh, I may have been here, but I do not remember this. So if there's anything here, I do not know what. Total distraction. <laughs> we're heading to an elixir well. Nope, not anymore. Now we're going up a random tower I found. What was that? I don't even know what I picked up there. Lots of creepy noises happening in here. Everybody seems to be dead. Is this... Oh, come on. That'd be a perfect little secret room. That is weird. I mean, I guess it's a good idea. So you can have a window. There's something in here. It's groaning and growling. Whoa. It seems like we're getting closer. So I guess it's at the top. What are you? Aha! Yep. I figured it out, guys. Yeah, only a level 11, though. Just wish I would have been able to got, get some uh, Fire 2 off on Fireball 2, whatever. You guys know what I mean. Yeah, these guys give you good amounts of bone and salt, apparently. Why do they give you salt? Because they're from Kaza. Uh, like, to... I think they call it fallowing a grave instead of hallow. You know, hallow is like, you know, holy gravesite or whatever, or ground or whatever. But I think if you fallow the ground, that's like, you know, unholy. Basically, it's the opposite. And they used to do that in like wartime. They would go through the fields and dump salt on the farm fields, you know, because then you can't grow anything. Because obviously the, the salt ruins, you know, the pH and mineral content of the soil. And it's actually really horrible to do, the amounts that they, they would pour. Like, the Romans, I think, were real big on that. Because you can't grow anything for, like, hundreds of years on that land. Because it's just so permeated with salt that, you know, it just basically turns it into a desert. Because nothing can live there. Um, but yeah, these do it. Okay, so there's the elixir well. Um, I'm going to hit up some more berries, actually. Um, backpack. Yeah. Because I brought them, so I'm going to use them and save us some health potions. I really need another fire wand. We've got three ice wands. Yeah, frozen, and then these are both ice. But only one fire wand. And the shroud guys are weak to fire. So, um... Oh, we don't have any shroud potion. I'm sitting here just talking, trying to wait for my health bar to go up. But, <clears throat> yeah. So it really sucks, because we only have the one fire wand. And I would like to have more fire ones, but we've got to be able to do one of these elixir wells, right? I'm just jumping in. Yeah, 
Screw whatever's up top. I don't think it follows you. <laughs> We're just trying to, you know, bang in here like the old character, which is not going to work out well. Why is that so bright? No, there's a weird light down there. So which way? It's got to be like straight behind that pillar. Is this another one with a thunder brute? I'll try going down. Whoa. A little more carefully. That's not quite the careful way I wanted to go down. Why? This character, I swear. The character is clumsy. Not me. Ooh. Dang it. Whoa. Ow. Ow. I was not paying attention. What level was he? I was totally not paying attention. Crap. Hmm. So what do we come back with? Like everything, basically? Except our... Um... Yeah, except our rested bonus. Oh, but we're in the shroud, so we can't... Yeah, and I just bombed in here like an idiot. Alright, so we're just going in. <laughs> rested bonus be damned. Oh, but um, not food and water be damned. And not health bar be damned. I'm just gonna go for, yeah, potions. Oh, and our shroud resistance, or whatever, our shroud potion goes away too when we die. And we, it doesn't do any good when you're in the shroud. It can't um, help out. Okay, so... Oh, hello? Oh. Who the heck are you, even? That's not fair. Shoot me when... I don't even know where he is. He's over this way somewhere. Oh, I hit him. They're only level 11. So I don't know why I was having so much trouble with this guy. Probably because I was not even blocking or anything. Blocking helps. Sure. Ooh, that was close. Ow, that was too close. Ooh. Come on, just go down. Yeah, and you... Oh, I don't know what I'm aiming at. Ow. Ah, gotta get out of that stuff. Oh. Just go away. Thank you. Oh man, don't do that double crap again. Eat that doubling up crap. Alright, yeah. Health. Health is good. And this, yeah, it would be better if we had our rested bonus. I'm gonna try right first. You are just a little bit better. Ooh, and you are a nasty flower. But I don't think you like Fireball too very much. No, you don't. He resisted some of it even, but it still blasted him. I'm not seeing the shroud root, but I'm hearing it. So, that could be good. Should be grabbing these, because you do need oh, shroud sacks for stuff. And that's a few I don't have to grab from the resource world. There, another flower. Oh, I think I remember this one. Possibly. I remember a section like this with all of these. Yeah, is it? Shroud root this way? Oh, crap. That's not good. Not good at all. They do that on purpose, don't they? I'm sure they do. Oh. And just go away. Oh. Alright. Or, oh. Is it the... It's, it's a skill, isn't it? It does the, the double... Yeah, I got that skill. That's what does it. Okay. It randomly does a second one. It's, I thought it was the wand, but apparently it's the stat. Because I haven't seen the wand doing it. Oh. Um, let's go ahead and do this. Yeah. And was there another one? That kind of looks like one. <laughs> I'm not taking any chances. There. Oh, and you? You can go away too. Alright. Yeah. Now, um, probably not worth fireball too. But okay. I'm trying to save my wand a little bit. I don't know why. Kind of junky. Where is. It's not on this side, is it? It's on the other side. I should have gone left at the beginning. Yep. It's looking that way. I don't even care if there is a chest over here. Because I am running out of time. 
and we need to chop down the old shroud root. We want to survive. So it's got to be this way. We hit a dead end. Yeah. There. How do we get up there? Oh crap. Um, man, this chick burns through stamina like nothing else. Whoa. Yeah, I don't know if that was the, such a good idea. And this chick definitely needs to go down. Because she is not friendly. And then, where's that archer at? I hit something with a critical. Not sure what. Yeah, he's over there somewhere. Oh, I don't have any freaking magic. There he is. Ooh. Oh, instead of yeah using magic, let's uh yeah, real quick go and hide over here and heal and some magic. Ooh. keeps killing my shroud time when he does that. I don't know what the heck was going on there. I was not in control for a second. There we go. Alright, so you had a spawner over here. Oh crap. Yeah. There we go. Alright. I think I might need to, yeah, run real quick and get some more shroud time somehow by like getting out of the shroud because I don't think we can manage it right now. It's just too many. Okay, so the best way to get out of the shroud is going to be straight the way I'm oh, oh. Freaking not fair dude sneaking up behind me. Ooh. Or is this out of the shroud? Oh this is out of the shroud. Okay. Get, a, get off of me. I didn't realize this was out of the shroud. That's perfect. Alright, we can do it then. Since I got my shroud time restored. Um, yeah, man is going to go up on its own alright, I think. Is that everybody up here? At least everybody's going to follow. Oh, man. Alright, there we go. Okay, back in. Now I got the shroud time. Should be good to go. Let's go down here take these guys out. Um, let's actually... Who's crunching around? Yeah, where is their spawner? Is it over here? Or was it on... It was on the other side, wasn't it? Um, right there. I think that was it. Ooh, ow. Oh, crap. No, I didn't want... I wanted the axe. Yeah, give me the axe. Critters. Just smack them. Ooh. Away. Is there any more spawners? There's more critters. Hear them. I think they're down there though. I think they fell and they can't get back up here because of that wall. Yeah, that makes sense. Alright, shroud root. It's freaking hidden in this one. This way? Yeah, this is the way, I think. From what I remember. Um, here, just have some of that. I'm tired of waiting on charge time. Alright, is that... is that everybody? Is it this way? I'm not certain it's this way. This is the one that's got the bomb ones in it, isn't it? Like, for the first time. Ooh. Yep, no thank you. It's it up here. Oh, this is the chest. Oh, crap! I was not paying attention to the flowers. Bad idea. And we can take you out from here, though. Yep. That's a better idea. Oh, that's the close one. That's the one that aggroes you. There. And then the rest of them join the fun. There, much better. They're all dead now. Get our chest. More daggers. Freaking A. I'm tired of the daggers. Yeah, I should do an archer build. <laughs> Screw magic. Magic is slow. There's no shroud root here either. Like, it, there's got to be a shroud root, right? It's an elixir well. They all have one. Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh, I hear him. 
Yep, we'll just go explosions from the get-go. Backstab damage. I'm not, I don't even see the dude anymore. <laughs> yep, we're just gonna rain hellfire. Ooh, yeah, they're getting close. Is there a spawner though? Yeah, this is kind of OP, to be totally honest with you. But at the same time, <laughs> I need to advance a little bit. So, I don't mind it so much. And hit the shroud root a bit. The mushroom in the way. Yep, trying to advance. No good for you. Oops. Oop. Yeah, you do have to hit at least close to it. Ooh. Crap. I'm out of stamina. That's, that's the other problem. Go back to what we know. <laughs> Just for a little bit. Alright, where is everybody? There he is. I see. Alright, can you oh. Yeah, it, it could warn you a little better that you're gonna get a second shot. Ooh. That is one issue I didn't really think about. Is that it leaves holes everywhere that you can then fall into. <laughs> so you have to be kinda careful where you use that tactic. Whoa, 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 whoa. Because they're definitely... Ooh. I don't, I don't know what I'm using right now. There are definitely areas where you do not want to blow up the ground. Especially around the shroud. So I'm glad this was not one of those areas. Ooh. I don't think I could have done that, though. Any other way. Ooh. Yeah, see holes. Because, yeah, this mage build is just not powerful enough. Yeah, I almost want to go and switch to a dagger, like a bow and dagger build, you know, go full deck. Um, I'm going to collect all this stuff, though, because I earned this. It, sort of. <laughs> um, the bow earned it. Yeah. Or the explosive, explosive arrows. They earned it. But I was, I was wielding it, and the bow can't pick things up, so it's mine. I think that's how that works. Right? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, and we did, we keep getting daggers, so it's almost like, you know, right now at least, the game is kind of balanced more towards decks instead of magic, because they said they're working on rebalancing the magic, so maybe, I don't know, you guys let me know in the comments what you think, if we should just keep on with the magic, or swap over to bows and daggers for the time being, but either way, let me know, um, yeah, and if you liked it, Click that like button, subscribe to the channel if you are not already. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Bye!